Well, let's turn to another drink. The mint julep. Let us talk about it a little bit. The mint julep is only made with fine bonded bourbon. The first dispute in making a mint julep is about the mint. You can do three things with the mint. Number one, you can leave the mint alone, which I do not recommend. Number two, you can hit the mint very hard with a mallet and crush it. Anybody who crushes mint in a mint julep is an unmitigated barbarian. Number three, the proper thing to do with the mint is you simply hit it once gently without crushing it so that the veins of the mint are open and the natural juice can pour forth. Now here is how to make your mint julep. You take a large pewter goblet. The mint should be fresh. If you have a garden, you can raise your own mint during the months of April, May, June, July, August, and September, and possibly October. Be sure the mint is fresh. If it has a withered look, it is not going to make a very good mint julep. Now, we're all set. Take your mallet and hit the mint once. Take your pewter goblet, silver goblet of glass, and place on the very bottom the bruised mint. Then take some finely shaved ice and put it on top of the mint and powdered sugar up to a height of about two inches. Fill the goblet of glass up in this manner till you are about two inches from the top. If you're afraid of your hand getting cold, I would suggest you wear gloves. Take about three ounces of old forest of bourbon. Put four ounces in a large glass if you have the bourbon. Take a large sprig of mint and put it in also. This is a mint julep. <laughs> 